The U.S. Senate has passed a bill introduced by a pair of New England senators that would make disabled veterans able to attend national parks for free. Maine Republican Senator Susan Collins and New Hampshire Democratic Senator Jean Shaheen, I always get that woman's name mixed up, Jean Shaheen, J.S., proposed the bill. It's designed to provide all veterans who suffered service-connected disabilities with free lifetime entry to any national parks. The 2004 Federal Lands Recreation Enhancement Act states that veterans must be classified as having a 100% permanent disability to get a free national parks and federal recreational lands pass, the senator said. Collins and Shaheen want to amend the law to apply to more disabled veterans. So they have a pretty rigid system of uh, determining what veterans qualify for free uh, national parks entrances and this bill is basically trying to give more of them uh, the right to go there for free and it, you know it's kind of disturbing to me that the um the laws would even be if I, I guess maybe i'm so used to seeing a lot of conservatives who will say oh we need to uh you know veterans they, they deserve assistance from us and then you when you find out that veterans make up 27 percent of the homeless it's uh all the more proven that people say one thing and do the other. But I find it really surprising that you don't really see that many conservatives rallying in support of this bill or really talking about it at all. Um, so yeah, I, you know, I try to do Colin stories every now and again, cause she, she does a lot of stuff I like. It's just, it, it's really a shame that the only thing she'll be remembered for is a stupid Supreme court vote. Hey, but at least, uh, the Senate, you know, passed, was this the first, this might be the first bill they passed all year that actually seems like it's worth the damn or something that's good. And again, I've, I haven't been paying as much attention to everything they've been doing, but I would say this is decent, uh, just objectively speaking. And it actually makes the U.S. not look like a bunch of hypocrites. Uh, even, if, even if I continue to mention the statistic of 27% of veterans uh, making up the homeless, giving them some benefits for their service seems like something people would be on board for and is long overdue. So, yeah, I've got no problems uh, in re relation to this bill other than the fact that people didn't think of it sooner.